it's Wilma Kaysen and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a requested video which is to kind of go over our little review and what fits in my Louis Vuitton Geronimo crossbody bag in the Dami Ben. so stick around. So to one of my newest subscribers, Joseph Cap. What's up, Joseph? Thank you so much for subscribing and asking to do this video. Joseph asked me about my Geronimo bag and asked me kind of what fits in it. Um, but he just acquired one and wanted to know kind of like how I carry it, mod shots, and actually what fits in it. So first I'm gonna show you guys what fits in the bag for kind of different occasions. First of all, let's talk dimensions of this bad boy. This piece is 4.7 inches in length, 7.9 inches in height, and 2.4 inches in width here. And it does have an adjustable strap, which has your gold tone hardware there, and your strap there. It is a zip closure on that side, nothing there. On the outside, it does have this snap pocket here, which I don't understand what one would put there, but you have that as an option. And the website says that there's a Velcro pocket in the back, which, oh my gosh. I didn't even recognize, guys. Okay, so here is what the back of this looks like, right? This is stitched. And I just assumed this was stitched as well, but look at that. It's a pot. Oh, there's your textile card. <laughs> it's a pocket there. It's not Velcro as the website mentions, but there is a pocket here. Who knew? Again, I don't know what I would put there. It's an open pocket. It's, it's a tight fit, but I don't know what I would slide there. So again, if you're wearing a crossbody, whatever is in there will be close to your body. But yeah, don't know what I would put there. So two pockets to put things in, this one here and this one here. Use your imagination. <laughs> but personally, when I use this bag, I didn't use either of those compartments. So let's go into the inside. When you unzip it here, you open it and it's just one large compartment, guys. I have stuff in this now, but it's just one large compartment and I will kind of go into the contents on what fits and then we'll go into what the inside of the bag is. When I travel and I use this for a day bag, I usually keep my wallet with me. I keep some sort of either sunscreen or like a spray to keep my skin hydrated and a pair of sunglasses if I'm wearing them, you know, I, a little bag to hold them will fit in here. The full case won't fit, depending on what you're carrying. So when I went to the Bahamas and I carried this, basically I had my handy dandy Caudalie grape water, which is amazing. I also have a pair of Chanel sunglasses here, which are just in the baggie. Like I said, the hard case won't fit, but that does fit in there. I have my sugar lip bomb there and I carried my passport in there as well. For those of you who are, look, who are looking to carry this bag more so on an everyday basis, not for vacation, let's pick a few key everyday pieces and see if they fit in this bag. So here you have the clay or key pochette, which you can house cards in. We're also gonna take a Louis Vuitton PM agenda. And lastly, we're gonna take our six key holder and see if that fits in it and see if there's any room for anything else. First item in. Here is the six key holder. Here is your clay. And I have everything kind of going in size order in the bag. So there's still, if I was to zip this closed, there's still a little bit of room here. So I'm gonna take my lip balm again, throw that in there. I'm also gonna take my iPhone 7 Plus and slide that in the back. It's closing right now, you guys. I'm actually going to take this and stick it back here because I wanna see if the sunglasses can fit. Here are the sunglasses in their case. And guys, everything fits. Again, we're gonna go over really quickly. You have chapstick, sunglasses in a draw bag, not the actual case. Your clay, 
six key holder, agenda PM, and your iPhone 7 Plus. All of that fits in this bad boy here. So basically you can see the bag is just an open compartment. There's no pockets on the inside. They really made up for those on the outside though. Um, there's no pockets on the inside. Here you have your patch that says Louis Vuitton Paris made in Spain. And if you're looking for the date code for this piece, that's what this little puppy is for here, that snap closure. My date code is hidden just up here in the corner. It's like right there. My date code is UB4136. So again, date code is hidden way up here in the corner. That's pretty much the bag. The bag currently retails for 1,150 US dollars and it's a phenomenal bag. Some people choose to wear it crossbody like this while others choose to wear it on their back like this. I usually actually carry on my back like this. I just find that it's a lot more comfortable this way. Wearing it cross body like this, just for my frame, does not work for me. I've seen people wear it like, like that, like this. I've also seen people adjust the strap and kind of wear it on their waist like that, which is fine if you're into the whole waist bag thing, but that really is not my thing. You can also kind of just throw it over your shoulder like a continental soldier <laughs> and just kind of carry it like that. So this is how I currently carry it when I use it. That's basically it. It works for me. It's easy peasy. So that is the Louis Vuitton Geronimo crossbody bag by Louis Vuitton. This only comes in the Dami event. It's never been made in any other print. It's a phenomenal bag, you guys. I love it. And clearly, I highly, highly, highly recommend it. Thank you guys for checking out this video. If you have any more questions about this item, please leave it in the comment section below. I will talk to you soon.